AI takes over ad creativity. Paid performance marketing is a true art, and one has to be experienced enough to make the right assumptions from the start. Usually, no one wants to spend too much money on experimenting without an acceptable return on this uh, investment in the end. You gotta spend money to make money. Spend it. Invest. If the first assumptions were wrong, or keeping low performance rate, a human marketer has to be able to optimize the ad at a very quick pace. Pace yourself. Take it quick, quick, quick. There are already many places where AI can be applied in online marketing and specifically in the paid performance marketing PVC field. The life cycle of a paid ad or ad journey, an ad that was created with the aim to be published on Google, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, Pinterest, or any other platforms that provide paid targeted advertisement as a service can be described as the following. First, very important pillar, ad creation, where the ideation process happens in the human's head, business owner, or a marketeer. It's the ad title or ad image or video and text to be produced. It is also suggested to work with multiple versions of ad creatives to achieve expected results faster by spending less money overall. Reason and creativity. Ad budgeting and placement is number two, deciding how much you invest and on which platforms you should place this ad. It is a known fact that less is more and focusing on one or two platforms generally better than focusing on too many at once. Of course, one needs to know which platforms are best for, specific, uh, for your specific product or service. And number three, ad optimization. Watching and modifying your ad performance day by day or hour by hour based on multiple parameters, age and gender of your audience, keywords, interests, cost per view, cost per click, which platforms per perform better, and many, many others. It's hard work. So ad placement is something that is already explored. However, it does not postpone serious challenge for technology, it's clear that the knowledge of ad placement and its compliance with any platform guidelines could definitely be taken over by a machine. The last part of the process, number three, is the optimization, has already uh, severely taken by over by tools existing on the market. The process of targeting the ad to the right customers and optimizing it during the life cycle of ad campaign can be easily delegated to a system that has way more knowledge about all types of businesses and campaigns than you or any human marketer. Cross-platform optimization, so reshuffling the budget between more than one platforms, is already mastered by us at Nanos and works even for smallest ad campaign budgets starting from $50, which are to be spread over, over, over several platforms and days. Creativity. Doesn't that sound great? What is really important to note is that so far, ad creation was barely touched by researchers and AI. Why? It is just too difficult even for a human to come up with a likable and visually appealing ad which has a catchy text as a title and as a description. The ad should be also grammatically correct and contextual so relevant to the website or a landing page where it is going to drive traffic to. Surprise me. It must be, it must be interesting. But guess what? A few weeks ago, we at Nanos received results from a user study conducted with over 20 participants. The questions were rather simple. Here's a short description of a product or service, and here are two ads about it generated from the description. Participants had to pick the ad that they liked better and assess if it was grammatically correct, likable, and contextual. Overall, five sets of textual ads and landing pages were presented. We asked a few simple questions. Did they like the ad in general? Was it put together as grammatically correct? Was it relevant to the information provided on the product description? What participants did not know was that one of the ads was generated by a human marketer and the other 
by the new Nanos machine learning algorithm. We were super curious to see the results, as by default we assumed that participants would choose ads written by a marketer. However, most participants preferred ads generated by the machine. That's a nice show. Very excited. You guys excited? Really excited. Really, really excited. We were surprised, but also very excited at the same time. It seems that the ad creativity, in particular the text, can now be solved without major human intervention. What does it mean for you as someone who wants to place an ad online? You don't need to think very much about what to put in your ad anymore. And on top of it, you can instantly create multiple versions of the same ad and test those on any platforms you want. This is a significant improvement in the workload of many marketers and agencies who currently spend enormous amounts of time coming up with and iterating ad content prior to publishing it online. This includes making sure that the ad resonates with its intended target audience, that it addresses the potential need of the viewer. Imagine instantaneously creating an unlimited number of ads, briefly checking them for sanity reasons and instantly turning them in for testing or removing the ad fatigue from old ads. You can test it internally, shake out the bugs and test it in combat. This is just one of the breakthrough milestones showcasing how AI can work hand in hand with the professional marketer and help save time and money. With AI becoming more and more intelligent and being able to detect any potential issues faster, it offers a promising look into the future of marketing. So are you ready to hand in your ad creation to an AI? For more information about this technology, please visit nanos.ai or contact us at ask.sasha at nanos.ai.